click on the subscribe button to watch more videos on my youtube channel and also click on this bell icon to get all notifications on your mail hi friends in this video i am going to explain how to develop the uh, 90 degrees elbow uh, bend in 3d i will explain this tutorial and you can observe the already explained uh, the 2d drawing of the elbow 90 degree elbow long radius bend already explained the 2d drawing in autocad you can observe on my channel uh, you can go on to my channel on the popular upwards this drawing is available uh, what explanation of the video is available and uh, this is the drawing i developed on that uh, video and pressure visual design guide you can observe on the below the playlist the pressure visual design guide one of the concept is there on the different types of concepts are available you want to go on to the uh, elbow bends how to develop the bends in 2d and the 3d as per the detailed design calculations or the desired design data uh, go on to the elbow pipe fittings on that you can observe on the playlist uh, some of the videos are available nearly uh, eight videos you can observe the introduction to elbows and the introduction is there and 90 degrees long radius span 2d drawing in autocad is there and 90 degree long radius span 3d in kt tutorial also explained in 3d also in some of the degree bands are also explained um, in previous videos the 3d drawing of the autocad not explained then only i want to explain these all bends in autocad by using the autocad software this is the 2d drawing already developed by using the uh, some of the dimensions this is the long radius 90 degree long radius elbow band of situl 40 thickness you can observe that these are the uh, proper data and the outer diameter elbow radius and the thickness is required if the, any of this and the, it is the 3 inch uh, elbow nothing but 80 mm elbow 80 mm in dimensions or not all dimensions are in mm i'm developing the drawing first create the new file and i'm uh, creating the i want to develop in 3d then only i'm creating the new file acad open with no template metric i want to develop this in all dimensions are in mm uh, units are in millimeters and 90 degree elbow long radius span this is the all of the dimensions 1143 and the 90 degree span is there you can observe that and circle c enter and you can observe that I am giving the radius of 114.3 of the circle of radius. You can observe the one of the circle is created. Use yes icon and by using the no. And after the giving the circle, I want to check the dimensions over here. Go on to the annotate on the 3D modeling. And you can observe the linear and some of the dimensions are how to mention this. You can observe I am giving the radius. This is the 114.3 mm and go into the modify you can also change the text and text height and the arrow size other decimals also i am giving the arrow size to somewhat bigger and click on ok you can observe it is as compared to this is so, so larger i want to again double click on that you can also give the dimension edit also possible and go into the d enter again dimension style and go into the modify i am going to the text size i want to give to 10 and symbols and arrow size is 5 and click on ok then 114.3 mm of radius is of the one of the circle is created and the dimensions are also good i want to develop is in 90 degrees uh, to develop the 90 degrees simply draw the vertical and the horizontal line to this simply mention the uh, you can observe this this 114.3 in the in between the angle is 114.90 uh, degrees angle and you can observe the 90 degrees is created and 88.9 is the outer diameter and 77.9 is the internal diameter to develop the 3d model the internal diameter is required after that you can create the outer diameter i'm mentioning the dimension over here 77.9 mm um, you can observe on the screen this is a 77.9 is the internal diameter 88.9 is the outer diameter of the elbow pipe you can observe the elbow bend and i want to develop this 77.9 one of the circle i want to create by using this after creating the uh, this circle you uh, the mention the thickness of 5.5 how i will explain see the full tutorial you can observe the 90 degrees of by using the two lines you can create the 90 degrees when this created simply trim the object by using the trim selection object and dr double enter and select the trim and the object is created you can observe you should watch the previous tutorial of the 2d drawing you can develop the 3d model simply on the 2d explanation is uh, uh, different from the 3d modeling then uh, you can observe the one of the line is required to develop 
uh, simply the 90 degrees angle creates simply give the radius of that uh, any of the uh, pipe bends and simply delete the, all of the horizontal uh, lines and the vertical lines over here i am deleting these two lines and this is the arc i required this arc uh, uh, radius is 114.3 simply i can observe the I am giving the circle and go on to the left view of the uh, AutoCAD and go on to the circle specified diameter. I want the internal diameter of 77.9 and simply go on to the diameter and check the diameter once again 77.9 or not. You can observe the 77. Then after go to 3D F orbit and simply drop a uh, object to the intersection to the end point of the arc and simply select the point and select the other point. Move the object like this and on that side and click on uh, ok you can observe the 3d f orbit you can revolve this the circle is created this is the internal diameter of the circle and the one of the radius is created of the band and simply go on to the top view over here you can observe the same type of band what is observed on the 2d drawing you can observe southwest isometric you want to change the southeast you can available different types of view styles are available in the uh, left side you can observe on the AutoCAD file then after go on to the solid uh, first go on to the surface model then after solid and go on to the surface and select the sweep object over here and sweep option and select the circle enter and select the arc enter then sweep is possible and also created you can observe this go on to the concept shell are realistic you can observe the 3d model over this is the simple surface is created not mentioned the thickness after giving the thickness you can observe the total bend over here the surface is created in the proper manner you can observe the surface is also created and the object is also on the 3d modeling is perfectly created of the two circles and after that uh, you can observe the screen and 90 degrees elbow radius 77.9 and 88.9 is the internal and outer diameter and the radius is 114.3 and 90 degrees bend it is and the 5.5 thickness is mentioned to develop the 88.9 mm simply go on to the solid editing on that solid editing you can edit the thickness or increase the thickness simply go on to the solid you can observe the solid on that solid observe the thickness on the solid editing tab and select the object and click on enter I'm giving the 5.5 thickness and click on enter. See the thickness is increasing. The inside diameter is 77.9 mm and the outside diameter is 88.9 mm. You can observe the thickness is also created. The bend is totally created. Go on to the realistic. You can observe the bend is like this. You can observe on the screen. This is the solid model. Simply create. You can observe on the screen. This is the solid model. Previous one is surface modeling. Uh, previous one is surface modeling this is the solid modeling you can observe i want to give, change the give the dimensions over here you can observe the <coughs> dimensions i'm mentioning i'm going to the linear see this outer diameter is 80 88.9 is okay over here and on the top and the bottom is both you should have the uh, 88.9 diameter is required this is the outer diameter first of all you create the uh, elbow with the internal diameter then after give the thickness value increase the thickness of that surface then simply you can obtain the outer diameter and the uh, what is the uh, mention uh, in the thickness you want you can also create the different types of elbow pipes with the different types of angles by using this method you should watch the both the tutorials you can understand clearly uh, and 77 point uh, 9 C simply you can obtain both are uh, okay this is the elbow drawing you can create in AutoCAD uh, 3d modeling workbench simply using this method and with Azure wish you can give the any of the dimensions also you can create the different types of models by using this and also give the different types of rendering materials to this and we also give the um, material browser also available you can give the different types of materials also I am saving this file to the desktop for example 90 degree elbow in AutoCAD uh, 2013 drawing to different types of drawing files are available you can also save these files in a different for uh, different versions also you can open 2013 or 14 uh, 2013 is uh, always open in 2000 and the uh, pre next generation versions on 2007 6 drawing uh, 
is also opens in the uh, old versions and you can observe the I am going to the viewport configuration and after that viewport conference select the four and you want to change the views of the top view side view you want to see the detailed drawing of that top view side view and the right view like that you can observe the 3d modeling on the viewport configuration on the visualize tab on the 3d modeling workbench then you can develop these models and you can also print the models by using the pdf um, and uh, default pdf is also already explained how to print this and you also know northwest isometric i'm selecting you change the realistics also of the individual objects you can also change the views also by using this viewport configuration the viewport configuration is very helpful after detailing of the drawing you want to give the dimensions individual to uh, detailing of the drawing this is very helpful to know